Hello, my name is Lucy Graham, and I want to welcome you to my video today. Today we are going to look at Kekish Credo number 21. This credo is talking about visualizing your goals. Let's begin. Kekish Credo number 21. Always have lofty, explicit goals and visualize them intensely. Assume the attitude that if you don't reach your goals, you will literally die. This type of gun to your head, forced focus, survival pressure mindset, no matter how briefly used, stimulates your mind, forces you to use your time effectively and illuminates new ways of getting things done. Always have lofty, explicit goals and visualize them intensely. Don't you just love that picture of the pussycat looking in the mirror and seeing himself as a big lion? He has lofty goals. A lofty goal is a goal that reaches for something of a higher standard and often requires overwhelming efforts to accomplish. Lofty goals are ambitious goals that are very beneficial as they can help you change and grow. Explicit goals are ones that are stated clearly and in great detail so that there's no room for confusion or doubt. Lofty explicit goals need to be translated into concrete actions. Visualization is the practice of an imagining what you want to achieve in the future as if it were true today. When I was coaching competitive gymnasts, I would have the girls close their eyes and visualize themselves doing a perfect beam routine. It made a big difference to the outcome of their routine. Visualization involves using all five senses, sight, smell, touch, taste, and hearing. When you visualize, you're directing your subconscious to be aware of the end goal you have in mind. By visualizing yourself reaching a goal, you are actually training your brain to work in a way that will help you hit that goal. Your brain interprets what you visualize as reality and creates new neural pathways to support that reality. Goal visualization forces you to acknowledge that good things can and will happen to you. To train your mind to focus on your goals and dreams, one needs to take pleasure in the little things and recognize the good in troubling situations. Expressing gratitude in all things is a good place to start. The benefits of focusing so intensely on your ambitious goals are many. This credo statement says it stimulates your mind. It forces you to use your time effectively and it illuminates new ways of getting things done. Take an inventory. Do you have ambitious goals? Do you visualize yourself already reaching that goal? Do you express gratitude for the good things in your life now? Here's your call to action today. Start visualizing your goals. Make sure your goals are very explicit in other words, written out clearly, then take action. Learn to express gratitude. I've been keeping a journal and in my journal, I write out three things that I'm thankful for each day. Subscribe to my channel and check out the description below as well.
you'll find the link to grab an autographed copy of my Traveling Tuesdays book. And you can also grab a free ebook. Have a great day, everyone. See you on my next video. Bye-bye.